if that who oh i see yeah you got the princess cup there she gives up her voice for a man <laughs> <laughs> hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions. It's up, Corbin. And I am Rick. And you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter, for it's juicy. So Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Patreon, follow us on 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 Patreon, Today, we are reacting to, I believe it's a trailer for a film called Iruvar. <laughs> Iruvar. Have you heard of it? Iruvar. No. Uh, it sounded like you were saying rhubarb. No, uh, but I see taboo. Yes. And Ashwari Rai. And? And Mahalio. Yes. Uh, and, and A.R. Rahman. Uh, so, uh, it's just by those alone it seems like it's going to be a great film um and i think i've heard a lot about it but it's a tamil language film um so iruvar is a 1997 indian tamil language epic political drama film co-written and produced and directed by uh mani ratnam who i believe is the director of uh Delce, i believe uh, the film, inspired by the lives of M.G. Ramachandran and M. something, is set against the backdrop of cinema and politics in Tamil Nadu. Cool. Cool. All right. I'm interested. I am interested. Oh, those three in that, with that music by that man? I mean, absolutely, I'm interested. Three, two, one. Is that supposed to be both? I don't know. Yeah, it looks like both, I think. Yeah, it's supposed to be both, I think. Hey, it's Mahano. Lenin, Stalin, Hitler, Yalarum, Kastapat, Savika Murijasaki, Bakal Manuska, the Pogam Rivasaki, Meta, the Wanago, Meta Pudum, what the Pilar, the Titta, the Pilak, 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 the She's so young. Yeah. So is she. <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, she looks like a Tamil actor. Yeah, she does. Yeah. Thank you, Mrenal. Yeah. Dogs. Please desist. 
<laughs> Sorry, my dogs are fighting. Um, anyways, um, so yeah, it looked interesting. Obviously, it's an old trailer, so as always. Dogs! Yeah. Babe, can you shut the door for me? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, anyways. But yeah, so it's hard to tell uh, with a with an old trailer um, because I don't think that was the official one. Yeah, because obviously no. they stop in weird places. Like, like you're getting into it, and then they just kind of stop, and it's like it's weird, and it takes you out of it um, yeah. for for a second. But uh, I'm interested in those actors. I'm interested enough in, in the story concept of it uh, and, and stuff. Like that. I think I've heard a lot about this as well. That it's like a, a really good film. Obviously, it should be yeah. those actors. Yeah, I, I really would like, with those actors, we already know enough about all three of them. Uh, the one, obviously, that I have the most, I just, they're, I want to see it. Yeah. Uh, yeah want to see it. I know you're a big fan of Taboo. Yeah, I love, I love her because she and Irfan, who work together all the time, but they were, before we started doing reactions, they were the only Indian actors that, I was aware of in American cinema that when I saw their face, I was like, oh, I know them. I know who they are. They do a lot of work. I didn't know their names. Yeah. But every time I saw them in something, I was like, I know. Who, like when we saw Life of Pi, I was like, I know who she is and I know who he is. And I, uh, so when we started to do reactions and were introduced to them, I already had a connection with, with Irfan and Taboo. Yeah. Yeah. And then obviously Ushoi Rai and, and Mahanal, which we're yeah. just learning about. Yeah. And he's a phenomenal actor. Uh, We've but- loved him. It's directed, yeah. written, and produced by Mani Rat, 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 cool. Ram, who who was uh, from Del Se, uh fame, and obviously composed by uh, Air Rahman. Came out in 1997. Um, won three awards. I don't know which award. A Filmfare Award for the South, National Awards as well. Uh, it's only two hours, 140 minutes. That's surprising, considering it's a 97 film. Uh, oh, sorry. Hour tw- 220. Sorry, not two hours. 220. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, 220. That makes sense. Um, but actually, we've seen that, actually. A lot of South are like Malalim. It's only like two hours. Uh, yeah, that's true. So that's interesting. Uh, but anyway, yeah. So let us know more about this film. Uh, if, if it's worth a watch, I, I believe from what I remember, you guys, because I remember seeing the name of this trailer a lot when we did mm-hmm. Mohano. Uh, is that his name? That's how you pronounce it, right? I don't want to mispronounce it. I, 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 yeah, I think it's Mohanlal. Um, With the L A L Mohanlal. I believe I remember people saying, "Watch this one," uh, for like really good acting. Um, political uh, dramas. I think we should be able to do right, or because I because obviously sometimes I have explained to you guys before comedies. Those are difficult sometimes. Like mm-hmm. the bull with Akshay, that one, that comedy, there was a lot of underlying subtext that you have to know that we do not. That we don't, uh, right. And, and so that's why you guys think that film's hilarious and we're like, oh, uh, what? what, what's going on? Uh, <laughs> and so that's, comedy is very difficult, especially if you have to read the subs, uh, if it's like contextual humor. Uh, yeah, I can, I actually just had a vision in my mind, like 10 years from now, we're gonna do movies that we had done before mm-hmm. and didn't get contextually, but we'll have a broader understanding culturally, and we'll like we'll call it the second review. <laughs> yeah. yeah, a lot of people will probably want that. Um, but um, yeah, yeah. So political dramas, I think, should be fine because normally they explain, and obviously there's stuff that's relatable across the globe, politicians in in that world but obviously right. it varies from state to state so and obviously we don't know in either of these people whoever these politicians are or or, mm-hmm. or figures are um so i'm hoping in the film that they would explain that because that would be yeah. my, my biggest like if they just assume you know who these people are like right like if like a film was depicting richard nixon and they just didn't explain right richard nixon if you didn't know right. anything about Richard Nixon and who that man was in terms of American politics, you might not understand it. And so that's what would be yeah. my concern. So you guys seen it. You guys can let us know if you think it's something that we would be able to understand because we, if it's good cinema, we want to watch it. 
Well, and it would be something like, I remember when we went in, they were recommending for us to watch um, Rang the Basante. And, and we, we knew very, very little about the Freedom Fighters. And, and they educated us yeah, they without really spoiling the film. Yeah, Great job. They've all, Stupid Babies have always done a great job. If it is one of those things of letting us know, okay, here's what you need to know contextually about the background of the politics without spoiling it for us. So, yeah. That's yeah. a good film. I enjoyed that film, Rang the Basante. Great film. Looking back on it. Anyways, let us know. <laughs>